The iOS 26.2 update is here, and it's packed with features. But if you hit update now without doing these three essential steps, you could face massive storage issues, data loss, or frustrating installation errors. I'm ProTech Genius, and I'm showing you what to check before you download anything. Step 1, the cloud backup check. The most important step, backup your data. Updates fail sometimes, and you don't want to be caught without a recent backup. Go to Settings. Tap your name slash Apple ID. Then select iCloud. Find iCloud Backup and check the last successful backup time. If it's old, hit Backup now right away. Step 2. Free up update space iOS updates often require way more space than they tell you. To prevent the update from getting stuck in a storage loop, you need at least 10 GB free. Go to Settings. General. iPhone Storage. Scroll down. Delete one or two of your largest apps, or offload old videos and large photo bursts. Step 3. Disable Beta Profiles. If you ever installed a beta profile for a previous OS or an app, it can confuse the new update process. Go to Settings, General, VPN and Device Management. If you see any configuration profiles, tap them and choose Remove Profile. Clean this out before updating. Once those three steps are done, you're safe to hit that update button. Your data is protected, you have enough space, and there are no profile conflicts. And speaking of settings, if you want to lock down your phone's privacy after the update, Check out my essential guide, iOS 26 settings you need to turn off now. Don't forget to like and subscribe to Protect Genius for more essential iOS tips. Now go get that update.